Hello, random YouTube people. Are you like me and you just upgraded your network and now your Ring doorbell doesn't work? In this video, I'll show you how to connect your Ring doorbell back to your new network. Hey, subscribe. First, locate and open the Ring app on your phone. You'll see a message that says this device is offline. Click the little red Wi-Fi icon in the bottom right and click reconnect this device. Next, it asks, has your Wi-Fi network changed? Yes, it has. Click on that option. Click continue to reconnect your device. And then it's gonna ask you to remove your faceplate. In the package your ring doorbell came in, you should have received a screwdriver to remove and install the safety screw. So you're gonna go ahead and remove that safety screw from the bottom and set those aside so you don't lose that safety screw. Next, it's gonna tell you to press this button on the side until you see the spinning ring. Here I am pressing that button on the side and you'll see the ring spinning white. Here from a different angle, you'll be able to see it a little bit better but you can see that it's now spinning. Back to the app, click on the light is spinning white button and you'll get prompted to connect to the Ring device network. So go ahead and click join and it's gonna scan your Wi-Fi for available networks. Then of course on this screen, you're gonna select your network from the list of networks that are around. Enter your password for that network and then click the continue button. It may take a minute or two, but it's gonna to connect to your Ring doorbell and this screen you see is device specific to my particular kind of ring, but then you click continue and success. Back to the app, you can go ahead and test some things to make sure it's working. I'm gonna check the camera and it looks like I'm getting video just fine. I can even just zoom in and yep, looks like everything's good. So you have successfully connected your ring back to a new network. The last step, of course, is to put your faceplate back on. So grab your faceplate, just push it back on until it snaps, then install your safety screw with the safety screw screwdriver, and you're all done. So really, it's as easy as that with Ring. They have a great app, and it's so easy to use. I hope you liked this video, and if you wouldn't mind, click subscribe. That really helps me out, and hopefully this video helped you out too.